Hello, Chobeggers. Welcome to Chobeggs Today, and I'm your host, Raymond Meriku, and this is Active. Today's show is themed man versus machine, and up first, we have Body Tag, which is a relatively new strength training class based on electro muscle stimulation. The hustle and bustle of Joburg can result into a hectic busy schedule which sees your health and fitness life being put aside. And for people on the go, BodyTech might be just a solution. And we got to explore the electro muscle stimulation 20 minutes workout session. And oh boy, did we get grilled. EMS training is 90% of your body muscles that's activated at the same time. So in terms of effectiveness, uh, we are, uh, you can train uh, 20 minutes which we activate 90% which is from your legs, your buttocks, your shoulders and uh, your back including your arms and core muscles all simultaneously at the same time. So a with a traditional gymming, a conventional gymming you're looking uh, you can activate either uh, one or a few muscle groups at the same time uh, and by the time you actually go through a full circuit uh, of training it could possibly take you an hour or more. And with us, we are able to activate all of those muscle, muscle groups simultaneously, so we are able to reduce the time frame in which you spend at the gym. Anyone from who's an athlete who's looking to gain uh, a lot of, uh, gain more strength, that little uh, but more extra strength, uh, to a person who wants to get into fitness. Uh, it's also a good way to get started, so it's not so intimidating. We don't have a lot of big bulky equipment that we use. So it helps a lot uh, on both spectrum. So there is a few medical conditions that people that we won't train under. Uh, it's being pregnant as well is one of them. It's mainly because uh, the intensity on your tummy is, uh, qu it is quite heavy. And uh, we actually haven't really trained anyone in, in that type of field. In terms of uh, pacemakers, uh, it is an impulse that we use. Uh, so we have not tr uh, trained anyone under that condition. There is a few more. We normally would request a doctor's uh, or a medical uh, certification from a doctor to, to continue any training with us. In the country, we, it's quite, South Africa itself is quite good. We have uh, 30 studios uh, countrywide uh, with, uh, with studios in the Western Cape, Natal and Gauteng. We have 11 studios in Johannesburg in itself. Uh, I would say it's definitely the future of uh, fitness uh, in South Africa. Um, actually, in, to, there was a FIBO uh, expo earlier on this year, which is one of the world's largest uh, fitness expos. And EMS training was uh, voted uh, part of the top five fitness trends for the future. According to BodyTech, the EMS training session ensures you meet the required threshold of your muscles to adapt to when training regularly and it will result in muscle growth, muscle activation and increased strength and power. And this is the pain we had to go through to see maximum results. I'm Ray for Tobik Today. Hey yo, what up ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Reason and you are now hanging out with me, Joburg Today. Let us know what you think of the first story of Active. Do make sure that you follow us on our social media platforms on Twitter, that's at Joburg Today, and simply like our Facebook page, that's JoburgToday.tv. CrossFit is an effective way to get fit. Anyone can do it, really. It is a fitness program that combines a wide variety of functional movements into a timed or scored workout. We try and prepare people for everyday life in terms of like the way they move, the way they pick stuff up, the way they lift stuff up, um, standing generally, uh, running, jumping. So we try and cover all aspects of fitness and obviously do it as safely as possible and within the best possible way that we can. So we use a lot of um, 
um, a lot of research in terms of the way we train people and uh, we're very specific on the way that people move. So, uh, you know, for, for them to uh, move badly, obviously that's going to carry over into everything. So our, our main focus here is to, to get people to move well and to um, be healthy and be fit and, and live well, really. We, we don't use any machines here. We obviously we teach people how to uh, do Olympic lifting, which is, um, which is what people see on TV when it comes to CrossFit and which is the scary part. If it's done correctly and if people are prepared properly, it can assist people with what they're doing on a daily basis as opposed to um, making them big, bulky and strong. So our job is not to make people big, bulky and strong. Our job is to get them to move well. We don't do the generic gym stuff. It's a very different, very different type of training. High intensity. Yeah, and obviously we take recovery days every now and then. Uh, another big mistake that a lot of people make is don't take recovery days, uh, which is important for the body. The intensity is quite high, um, but again, it's done. if it's done smartly, it's quite okay for the body. You do get some gyms that uh, go too hard too often. So yeah, today was a recovery day um, that you work out that you did. The intensity, when we do go hard, we go hard, but it, it's very well planned and, and you know, not every day is hard. Some days are a little bit lighter and we work on more technique. We, we sit and we program so that the intensity is done and planned really, really well. Yeah, it's a very competitive sport. Um, it's growing in competitiveness here in South Africa. Uh, we, we are slightly far behind, um, slightly behind in terms of like the international uh, stage. The everyday tr person that trains, or the person that trains every day, is not necessarily a competitive CrossFit athlete. It's like any other sport. You can play soccer for social, and you can play soccer competitively. Same thing. You can run for social, or you can run so uh, um, competitively. It's exactly the same thing with CrossFit. So, not everybody that comes into a CrossFit gym has to compete. Um, yes, if you're here in a class and it is a highly competitive workout, you find that people do compete compete against each other, um, but again, it's completely up to the coaches to keep them doing it as safely as possible and in the best way possible. It's not about uh, beating people, it's about living healthy. Give it a try, it's, it's the most amazing thing, it'll literally take over your life. They, people call it a cult, and there's a reason people call it a cult, because literally it takes over your life. It's, it's, it's exciting, it's fun, it's a fun way to work out. Um, it always keeps you interested because you're always driving to try and get something else and do it better and uh, you know, try a different movement that you can't get. There's some, there's some really highly technical movements that you see the, the competitive athletes doing that you know, people, people strive, only strive to try and get. So um, yeah, if you want to get a, a good, fun workout and um, Get into shape, Mom, I believe that CrossFit is the way to go. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Anati, the electronic bushman, sexy chubby, and you guys are tuned in to Joburg today. For more news on the city, do check out our playlist. Also, for me, Ray, and the rest of the Joburg Today crew, stay active.